and we're back in video number two for the Acronis True Image free trial. In this video, I'm just going to show you how to install the software. This should be pretty, pretty self-explanatory, but just in case uh, you're wondering, if you remember, let's let's start that over. If you remember, we installed it or downloaded the software to um, a file folder under Downloads. So we come in here to Downloads and we find it right there at the top. We can just double click on it. And then it will start the install. I'm going to close that. You can see it's ready to install. So I'll click install. And it's going to download the software now. Depending on how fast of an internet connection you have, this could take uh, several minutes, several hours. I have a fairly fast internet connection um, with my internet service provider. So this should download in no time. And then once it downloads, we'll go through these steps of. Um, of installing the software on your PC. Okay, it's done downloading and now we're going to uh, finish up here and it will start the install process in just a moment. Okay, we're unpacking the files and we should be up here in a minute. And now it's going to install the software on the PC. Now the install process could take some time, so we will uh, pause this video and check back in in just a moment. Okay, it is done installing the Acronis TrueMage software. So now what it's prompting us to do is start the application. As you can see, it also installed a little icon on our desktop. And if we come over here to the Start button in Windows, we can also see that Acronis TrueMage 2016 is here, along with all of its other bells and whistles that it uh, installs. So on your first install, though, of the software, you can actually click on the Start Application button right here and then it will load up in just a moment here on your PC depending on how fast of a PC you are installing it on. The first time it uh, comes up you have to accept the agreement. Click OK. And then we are ready to go. We just have to sign in with the email address that we used and uh, create a password for registration. And that will be about it. In our next video, we will take you through the setup of a data backup job on the Acronis software. Thanks again.